Hello there and welcome back. We do have a bad tide approaching which is pretty perfect for us because we have been building this levee wall over here and I mean we're halfway through here but I think uh, okay you're gonna go up and a lot of water is gonna go through here. Yeah so that should be fine. I think we can direct most of the water here. Now to keep this area safe over here let me just speed up the time a little bit as well. Uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. So this pool was fine and I believe it was working pretty nicely in the previous bad tides situations whereas this one's slightly newer and I am a little bit concerned because it's a lot smaller but I guess we'll see how it will go. And there we go I'm just gonna pause this real quick because uh, let's just have a check. Everything is at zero that is good same over here. It is already spilling over in here which is unfortunate well I mean it is pretty full of water. Maybe that's something we should do here as well. Maybe these walls should be a little bit higher. Just one tile above the water level. Okay, well that's something to note for the future. And what about you guys? Okay, so you... You should actually be a little bit higher, shouldn't you? Bad tide, there's nothing for bad tide. Oh no, you're being controlled from both sides. Okay, interesting. So when the bad... Hmm... Yeah, I think we're gonna lock you and open you. That's exactly what we should do. And let's have a look. When the drought ends, height is gonna be one. You should be fine. And uh, let's just raise all these walls. We'll keep the water in this area. And... <laughs> yep, it's definitely getting a little contaminated over here. Oh dear. How is... Oh, I see. Okay. Well, that's no good, is it? We're going to have to do something about this over here. Uh, Access-wise, I guess it's going to be a little bit quicker. If they just... Ah, oh, this is a little bit annoying. You totally missed this. And the highest of priorities as well. Okay, there we go. And then... Um, <laughs> we're going to have to build something around here probably for you guys it's the same let's do the highest of priorities and get this done um this area is pretty safe over here so so yeah five days of band tide so all of this should be fine what's the priorities over here okay so fine a couple of you can carry on with this construction over here the solution is well we're gonna have to widen this canal now isn't it all right these roads can go and <laughs> we are gonna do dynamites the small ones here and the next ones just I think about here should be fine right and then smaller ones here again right so there we go I'll pull this road over as well and then access wise, I think we were going to pull the power from here, wasn't it? Oh yeah, so the roads are going to change up a little bit. Fix you up real quick. And there we go. Let's have a look. Oh dear. That is looking nasty indeed. What can we do though? Okay, the highest of priorities. Let's go this way. And then what we'll also do. We're not going to be able to complete this whole wall in here. However, if we can do this section, that that would be that would be wonderful. Maybe we we'll give you a bit more access from here as well. Might get it done a little bit quicker. Who knows? Okay. Oh dear. That means some beavers are gonna be unhappy in here, though, aren't they? Right, right, right. We can't have any construction beavers. Yep. You're gonna have to change the pots. I'm afraid. Um, I just don't want to risk them getting sick again. Right, so where can we pull some more? I guess we can reduce you guys. Let's take maybe five out. We've got tons of scrap metal right now. Oh yeah, there's plenty of that. Okay, that gives us a few more... A few more bots. I don't think we have any more construction beavers, do we? It should be fine. Okay, so let's have a look. You guys are now doing this. Dynamites are coming in. It is getting 
contaminated. Oh dear, this is looking pretty nasty as well. You are all locked up, so that is good. Have we done those stairs? Oh yes, we have, but no one's really done this bit in here, have they? Okay, levies. Let's get this done ASAP. The uh, highest of priorities. Uh, <laughs> they are going to get contaminated here, aren't they? Okay, pause this one. Oh yeah, that's going to flood. And uh, how did we miss this one? I mean, I guess it was sort of like tucked away in here. Don't feel... Okay, just in case. Maybe. Maybe, just maybe, we're going to have to pass the water into into this little canal over here in the future. So we're going to leave, leave those levees in place. we got 12 spare beavers right now. There's no point putting them in here because they're going to get sick straight away and then they won't work. So... I guess we could... Yeah... Well, even if I place them here, they're going to get injured. Maybe this is the solution. Let's have a look. Couple of these buildings. How are you guys going? Oh, that's looking all red now as well. You guys are all out of power. Oh, hold on a second. Maybe something we could do in here. Since we are... Yeah, let's get one of these ones. Uh, the charging stations built in here as well. Might be helpful. I mean, it's quite a, quite a long way for them to run, isn't it? And I guess we can call this a mission fail. If we want to save the, the rest of the tank over here, especially those mangrove trees, it will be best to allow the water to pass through here rather than this way. So it should start flowing through here any second now. Okay, there it goes. That's reduced to zero. Hopefully this is still closed up because we don't want to contaminate this area in here. There we go. All the dynamites uh, should be in place and I would like to open this up but those bots are just in the way. I think they're just trying to get those uh, levies done but we have no time to waste. Here we go. It should all start flowing out now and hopefully... Yeah, hopefully it's not gonna over flood or flood this area any further than it already is. Okay, we're well, just gonna let it flow for, uh, for a little bit. Now, we do have to close you up eventually as well, so we'll schedule you in there. This can go about here, and I guess those walkways should have been here instead. All right, and oh yeah, these ones are gonna have to go here eventually as well, which means the roads well, let's not worry about the roads right now. We can always redesign and plan this area. I just hope they can get all of this constructed in time. Right, so the beavers, or not the beavers, the bots have actually managed to finish a little bit in here as well, which is fantastic to see. Let's give you guys the highest of priorities. I have a feeling it's, um, yeah, a little difficult right now. Let's unpause you. Okay, yeah. Uh, we, we already have uh, quite a few high priorities in the other part of our colony, so so maybe it is not the highest of priorities. Few beavers are unwell. Not really sure why. There's no reason for you to go in here, or is it? No. But this area is getting done pretty quickly, which is lovely to see. I think we would like to close you up as soon as possible. Oh dear, but that's not going to be enough now, is it? We're going to have to expand you through here as well. And then going to have to delete some of these sections in here too. Ah, oh, what a nightmare. Okay, that's not a huge priority. These can go through. At least we learned, learned about it now. We kind of had this feeling that the next bad tide might be disastrous. I think we've managed to sort of avert the biggest of crises because we were sort of aware of it. Or at least of the, the potential of it happening. So, yeah. At least with the, what is it, the next bad tide, we'll be a little bit better equipped and prepared. Okay, you're gonna go here. No, not this one. Maybe highest of priorities. This one can be higher, but not the highest. And then, I don't know, maybe this one here as well. And then what we'll do is 
Let's grab these couple of things because this levy here isn't the most important, but I just want to get these bits done so it looks a little bit better. Yeah, I, I think we'll be fine. This section, well, it's good to see that, that it's working. So that is very, very lovely indeed. Now, if we can save the mangroves over here, then I would be super happy. Oh yeah, definitely. Please get this done as quick as you can so no more bad tide is going to flow into that area. Probably have to pause you. Oh, never mind. This will be done. It doesn't spill over there just yet. Can someone just have this last corner levy done here? It's really hurting my OCD. Yeah, well, I think we've saved it. Not sure how quickly it spreads over here, but um, 2.5 days. We, we should be okay. Right, they'll get the last of the chunks done as well. I don't think it's going or flowing back into the tank from here. These bits will be done and oh yeah, they're probably out of power. So that's why it's a little bit slower. Okay, now you lot over here. You are building up this wall because you have nothing else to do. All right, let's have another look over here. Okay, so you have completed this section. We are going to remove everything from here. Let's see what's going to happen now. What if we cover you up as well? Oh, we've lost the mangroves, haven't we? Yep, that is unfortunate indeed. And it means we are... It's probably better to pause a couple of these foresters over here. Oh, this is very sad indeed. Pause you. Why is the water flowing this way? Are you still open? Hmm. I think that might be my mistake, isn't it? All of this is flowing out from here. How high is the water level? Well, it's not too high right now. And I know it might be difficult to see, but... um, How is it going here? Okay. There we go. They still have access. Oh. No, I can't delete this section or this levee from here just yet. And uh, right, so what is our next priority? I think it's time to get those... Pillars done over here. The question is, how far up can they go? Or when do we have to start putting down some ladders to support the construction in here? I have a strong feeling that everything in this area will be very difficult to have it done. So let's just help them out with some ladders and things in here. All right. So there you go. Now they should be able to go up from here. And then we might even have to do a bit of a tower from here. Now, I have a feeling that maybe, just maybe, we don't have to build those supporting platforms in here because we have a ton of terrain blocks. And uh, hopefully, because everything is set to the lowest of priorities, they should be able to hop onto them whilst they're constructing some new ladders as well. So uh, it should work out. Then we're also going to have to get some better ladders or... The bridges for us. What's happened over here? Why is this not connected properly? Hmm. Did we plan to do some more pillars over here? I think so. At least I'd like to do some pillars instead of placing these platforms. Uh, what about on this side? Okay. And then uh, if we want, we can even... Wait, you're going to go over here. And then, yeah, maybe this is where we have like another pillar somewhere around here. Well, that's the wrong thing. All right. I don't really know where and how, but we're definitely doing something bigger over here. And then a little bit more in these corners. Okay, that's lovely. That goes up. And then you can go a few more levels as well. Let's just slow down the time a little bit. 0 0.5 days left. And then what I'd like to do is... I don't want to... Hmm, they are kind of lined up now, aren't they? Okay, let's bring this one down. And... Where can we connect you up from? If they were to connect up from here... Or maybe from this side... Then this could be... Interesting for sure. But I have a feeling that... The bridge will have to be from this side because we can't do a platform on on this pillar here. Oh yeah, that's definitely going to be a little bit more difficult, isn't it? 
Fortunately, they are building this up pretty quickly. Oh, hold on a second. It's still bad tide, isn't it? Um, right, quick check. Uh, this one is done, which we are happy with. The next step should be... Oh yeah, we're probably going to have to wait till the bad tide is over to fix it up a little bit. Okay, mangroves are alive as well, which is good to see. And this area over here is very disappointing, I must say. What can we do? We don't need this central section here. Yep, all of you can go. And we'll have to let through a bit more water in here as well. Okay, right now you guys can still run through this area, so that's fine. And then, okay, don't fall down, but we're going to place these platforms here instead. And that's flowing through. Have you completed these ones? Yes, you have. Is this enough, though? Is it going to save this area? Is the question we have. Doesn't look like it. It still looks like it's flooding this area. Bad tide has ended. It's interesting. So this is six tiles wide. I mean, what we could probably do is maybe lower this as well. Floodgates and in here. Make it a little bit deeper and hopefully allow a bit more water to pass through this area. Okay, well, fortunately, we do have the bad tide finished now. So we should let some more water to pass through these areas. That's going to flood. This one's fine over here. Let's see what's happening in here as well. Oh, hold on a second. We're always going to keep some bad water in here which is going to be a little bit annoying isn't it uh, let's lift you up maybe 1.5 yeah this automatic filling the this area here might prove to be a little bit more difficult maybe we should use like let's have a look where are you uh bad water pump fluid dump uh it's not really okay deep mechanical fluid pump you cost 5000 however if we were to place you... Okay, that's going to be a little bit annoying. Let's see, on this side over here, we could pump out clean water. And then dump the um, dump it on this side. But the problem is it takes a lot of power, isn't it? 700. And it's not going to gain us anything. Decisions. Okay, right now, I don't think we need this very desperately. We are going to flush out all of this nasty looking water. This area is lovely. That's going through here. Nothing's flowing through here. That is probably... Let's put you back on uh, 0 0.5. Allow this to go through here. Oh, hold on a second. I think we were... Expand our power production a little bit further in here now, weren't we? Okay, so that is exactly what we shall do. All right, two wheels on this side. We can connect it up with power once they get built. Yeah, this side is going to be the same. Delete all the, the roads. Where are you guys going? Okay, just... Hmm, no more storage. Uh, not to worry. I'm sure... Eventually this is going to be useful. So, uh, yeah, that one is going to be done. Why is the water not flowing through? Okay, maybe it is but very slowly. All right, we're just going to drop you a little bit lower. Make sure we flush out all the bad water because I would love to... Yeah, it's very sad about those mangroves in here, but um, okay, fine. Now uh, that's still flowing in here. You guys are hopefully fine. Some beavers are gonna definitely going to get sick here as well, contaminated. Don't tell me you're in this area. Oh, okay. Right, so one of you goes here and where can we place the other one? I don't think we were prepared to get some beavers sick in this, in the scrap city. Right, so some beautiful juicy looking water here. You should be now closed up as well. I don't want any water going off the map. I want it to go into this tank here instead. All right, lovely. All closed now. Right, so to further improve this area, we're going to do a couple of things. First, we are definitely going to need some trees for the beautification and uh, yeah, well, there's no end. It's just beautification here, really. Then uh, the next step, what I'd like to do, I'd like to make sure that those floodgates are A, plentiful, and B, right at the end over here. Because what happens quite often is that bad water still lingers around some of these areas. So I definitely want to flush it out as much as we can. And I'm going to place them just on the outside, four of them to make sure the volume is strong enough, but also that we have the number 
a good number of floodgates in case we need to sort of like direct it to just one side or the other side then uh, we should be hopefully prepared right now they're just carrying all the resources over and I think yeah we can do one side at a time this one isn't the problem they've done okay I'm gonna lower the level here as well double platforms that's how they can cross through now. So what is very interesting is that this section seems a lot smaller. What is it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. About 20 of them. I mean, I don't know the strength of those water sources. How many in here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, okay. I think we know the reason why things didn't work out. That's because I was I was not very smart, was I? It just looked like this area was smaller, so I kind of assumed that the amount of water that's going to be pushing through this area is going to be uh, hopefully less, but no. So what we'll probably have to do here is ensure that we can send a bit more water through this whole area. So that means, yeah, all of those trees are going to have to go. We're going to expand our road network a little bit. And then I think in here, this is where I would like to place one of these tiles instead. And, oh yeah, all of you are going to have to shift a little bit as well. Maybe through here. We'll leave you at sort of like a medium priority task. Okay, so you are all able to cut all those trees down right so that's lovely we'll clean it up dynamites will go in place and yeah we'll just get it done now beavers are sick and complaining let's have a look at this area oh yeah it's definitely not looking very very nice is it so you can go here i'm surprised they managed to oh yeah they can probably run here and complete it Okay, so all this water, I do want it to flow into here. Okay, since we have a few spare beavers, now is probably the time to ask a few extra foresters to get back to work in here. Just to make sure that those coffee plants are done. I, I mean, it's not like we need the coffee, but it will just make this area look a little bit nicer. I guess that's the main reason why we're doing this. Okay, over here, empty, empty not good unpause you is it flowing through we can probably drop you down let some water go that way as well i mean i don't want to green up this mountain that's the unfortunate side effect it seems now how are you guys doing over here we're getting some of those ladders up already which is fantastic okay maybe it is time that we make them a little bit more important just a few sections okay how about a couple of you guys this one here okay now we're getting somewhere you have problems over here and we totally understand that you're gonna have to climb up just a little bit same thing in here isn't it okay couple of these ones and then we need to go here few more hopefully you're not gonna get too stuck in here we're starting to get somewhere now and then we are gonna need well we don't need the ladders here just yet because we don't know the design of this do we how do we want to make it i would like this to be pretty big pretty high tall yep these sides i do want it to be definitely a bit more random as well Okay, how about we go... Oh, that's already the highest. Well, that's okay. Now, is this good enough for us? It's going to leave a quite a substantial glyph in here. Oh, yeah, that's definitely something we do want, isn't it? How about we bring you... Okay, not entirely sure... Let's do something like this in here. No, it looks too much like the stairs. So maybe we take just a few out. 
How about now? Okay, leaves us a bit of space for development in here. And then if we can get the right angles... Let's have a look. Grab one of those bridges in here. Uh, here we go. This one... Oh, you might be too high. Okay. So that can go about here. Do we like this though? That is the question. Uh, let's have a look. We've got a platform in here, another one in here. Oh yeah, we can't move this bridge over here. I feel like this, like this section might be too low. So what I'd like to do, I'd like to create a bridge from, from here instead. Yeah, this might make a bit more sense now, isn't it? Uh, that's going to cut into our tower. But I feel like it's still better than having it this low in here. Will we be able to build those platforms? Oh, no, we won't be. Oh, yeah, what might happen is once these um, dream blocks get built, next time we load the game, they're just going to disappear. That's what probably happened in here as well when we booted up the game and uh, some of those side platforms were... We're just missing so yeah we're definitely gonna experience this more around this area so we should be more careful right so here's what we do we're gonna build this uh science points 800 okay we got the science points that's fine uh so you go over here we got the roads in place now to pass through and go down that's where it gets a little bit more interesting i do want this to be a little bit higher so i think we could cut off this road in here okay so how about we climb down from about here oh you've already constructed these areas well that's unfortunate but um okay fine we'll have to use some dynamite i suppose um okay you're doing this bit here as well which is unfortunate but or maybe not maybe this will be fine let's give them a little bit of access for the time being and then for the future we'll use a bit of dynamite in here pass them through oh yeah i think i'm starting to like this idea okay and another one that goes up from here then they can walk through crossover and we'll be fine yeah okay so that's gonna be lovely now let's just have a quick look at the progression of everything in here maybe a little bit higher great like this little pool uh, that's uh, still not the cleanest, but we're slowly flushing it all out. Okay, we can do another another one of those wheels. Seems a bit of water is spilling through. A lot is spilling in here as well. This whole area is flooded. Okay, so yeah, we are definitely going to need to widen this area by quite a lot now, isn't it? Okay, these roads can go as well. We are going to place dynamites all throughout this area. Smaller ones at the end. This road can go and big ones here again. Then uh, double in here. Right, so this might actually work quite nicely. I mean, it seems the volume here is twice as big as it is in this section here. So... Might have to widen this by... Well, let's see. Maybe four canals are going to be enough. And if it is, then this setup could be pretty wonderful. Because every time it sort of starts flooding or we want to generate some power, we just have to open one of those sections. And yeah, we don't have to like open this whole area, but we can do it in steps instead. But okay, so uh, that's been quite a bit of work on having this area a bit more organized now and more bad water prepared so this tank in here i call it a mission success nothing really spilled into the tank from here so that's all good when we went wrong we totally missed this spot in here there's another water source so i think that's been dealt with now as well then let's move over to the top this pool in here this one was absolutely fine and we have no problems at all and then this one, the last one in here, it seems we still have some smaller problems, but as soon as this section is done in here, I think we should be good. But let's just let them 
finish the construction and then we can test it out. Right, so we have completed the fourth and the last channel and it seems it is now working. Water is not really flooding over those levees and I mean of course we had to remove all the all the other levees in here and allow it to I think right now it is passing through the first canal and the fourth one as well. So as long as these ones are open. Okay, so you are open as well, but not a lot of water is going through here. We could probably... Uh, you are 0.5. Right, so what we can test is if we close you up, this means the water cannot escape through here anymore and will push through this area instead. Which means I think it should be fine because this um, the river here is still very much functional and 0.5 is okay here as well so yeah i think it's working right so with that being done in my opinion it's a pretty big milestone for us uh, having these both sort of pools um sorted out now really is the necessary foundation for us to start building a functional city on top of it we are gonna hold with this just for a little longer because I do want to test out a, another bad tide. So hopefully it's going to arrive soon. Who knows when it exactly will be here. But after we trial out yet another bad tide. Then we will know for sure. And we can start laying the foundation. Well the foundation is already here. But we can start planning out our beaver city. Beaver Venice in here. And build it over the next uh, several, several episodes. Then the next thing that I'd like to do in here. I do want to create like little canals and these will be sort of hydration canals in case we get some longer droughts and the water evaporates from here then i definitely like to keep a little bit more water around the edges of the lake i mean if we do get enough dynamites then i wouldn't mind dropping the levels all together but i mean this would probably take quite a few dynamites so for now i'm just doing little sections around the lake when and where i remember to do that but all right that will be the end of this episode so thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one